In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for LiOH, that's lithium hydroxide. So lithium, this is a metal. And then when you have the OH, when you have OH bonded to a metal, it's called the hydroxide ion. It's a polyatomic ion. So let's write lithium, that's Li. And lithium is in group one on the periodic table. It has one valence electron. So the hydroxide, it's a polyatomic ion. And we could write the Lewis structure for the hydroxide ion like this. It's OH minus, and you'll note that these electrons right here, because oxygen and hydrogen, they're both nonmetals. This is a covalent bond, so we're sharing these two electrons here. So this is our hydroxide ion. If you need help writing the Lewis structure for the hydroxide ion, there's a link in the description of this video. So we have our lithium, that's our metal, then we have our hydroxide ion, and the hydroxide ion it's negative because lithium, it loses this electron here to the hydroxide ion. Since it lost an electron, it's positive. The hydroxide gained that electron, that's why it's negative. And now you have a positive ion and a negative ion, and they're attracted together. That forms the ionic bond. So this is the Lewis structure for lithium hydroxide. And the brackets here, they show that this pair of electrons right here, it's not shared. This is an ionic bond. So we're not sharing these electrons in the brackets. They show that that's the case. Sometimes you'll see brackets around the lithium ion as well. So this is our Lewis structure for lithium hydroxide, L-I-O-H. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.